Whether you've just changed your guitar strings or are getting ready to remove your old set, it's important to know how to properly cut your strings. I'm Connor from Roundtable Audio and today I'm going to show you how to cut your guitar strings including three DIY methods using household items. For a full six ways, check out my website linked in the description below. The best way to cut your guitar strings is to use a pair of wire clippers. These are designed to handle guitar strings and will cut through cleanly and easily. To cut your guitar strings, put the wire cutters over the string like a pair of scissors and squeeze them shut. For thicker strings, you might need to squeeze hard or use two hands. If you're removing excess string, cut as close to the tuning post as you can without catching any of the wound string. As a rough rule, I like to leave about a quarter of an inch of the string. If you're cutting your strings to remove them from your guitar, then make sure that you fully loosen them by tuning them all the way down. Cutting strings that are still tight can be dangerous for you and your guitar. If you don't have a pair of wire cutters handy, you might still be able to cut your strings using some household items. I tested these three out with mixed results. Now, these aren't meant to replace wire cutters, which is still the best tool for the job, but you can use them if you don't have anything else to hand. As a warning, don't use an open-faced blade like a knife or saw, as you risk damaging your guitar and hurting yourself. Your strings are thick and slippy, and that can easily cause problems. First up, we have nail clippers. Most people will have a set round, and I've found that they're surprisingly useful at cutting through guitar strings. Make sure that they're heavy duty clippers though. These are actually my top pick for a DIY string cutter, as they worked really efficiently. Next up, we have scissors. Heavy duty scissors, like kitchen scissors, are able to cut through strings, but it is a bit tough. Craft or salon scissors won't work though, they're just too weak. As a tip, keep the string as close to the base as you can for more power. It's worth bearing in mind that your strings will probably blunt your scissors a little, so it's probably just best to pick up the right tool and get some wire cutters. Finally, let's try some garden shears. Handheld garden shears are designed to cut through branches, so they're able to handle your guitar strings. Having said that, they do struggle with thinner strings, but if you keep going, it will weaken eventually until the string comes off. These are probably the least effective on the list, but they're still usable if you're desperate. So if you ever need to cut your guitar strings and don't have a pair of wire cutters handy, then I recommend going finding a pair of nail clippers. But I always recommend using the right tool for the job. So if you can wait, just pick up a pair of wire clippers. They're really cheap. For more info, check out my website linked in the description below.